So I could come in here and just to demonstrate this, I could come to the file and go to the 3D space and I'm going to delete the um, the cut and simply the fill, which is pretty typical. You see that updated quickly in the dynamic section. But if we look here, I still have the unsuitable remove and replace and the remove because that was also created from the cut fill tool. So what I'm going to do is rerun the tool and show the enhancement. In this case, I'm going to run it without the unsuitable. And I'm going to just say volume cut, volume fill. And hit no to the other two. Um, two. I'm going to have a question, do I don't want to delete those previous results? Basically, deleting the other items from the file. The other cut fill meshes, the unsuitable, the substrata, and the custom. Or I have a choice to keep them and just run the tool anyway. In this case, I'll say yes to delete them. And then it's going to just perform, after deleting them, it's going to um, perform the cut fill task to um, creating the mesh. Now we can see that the cut fill has been created. And this time we should not have the re remove and replace. You can see they're removed from the file. So it did exactly what we told it to do. Delete the existing cut fill and um, create the new ones.